Good morning, here is today's prayer. Dear Heavenly Father, My Lord Jesus, please rule over, fill and bless all areas of my life. Even in the darkest parts of my heart, your presence brings light, hope and redemption, I welcome you. Lord, protect me from the lies the enemy tells me. Please help me to live a sober and vigilant life. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary the devil walks about like a roaring lion, seeking whom he may devour. 1 Peter 5 verse 8 My identity and worth are grounded in you. Please reveal your truths to my heart so that I can have your peace and strength during times when I am tested. Help me to trust in you and your holy word. You who fear the Lord, trust in the Lord. He is their help and their shield. Psalm 115 verse 11 I will turn to you in my times of weakness. I will seek after you and your goodness instead of looking to others. But I am like a green olive tree in the house of God. I trust in the mercy of God forever and ever. I will praise you forever, because you have done it. And in the presence of your saints I will wait on your name, for it is good. Psalms 52 verses 8 to 9 Thank you, Almighty God. In the glorious name of Jesus I pray. Amen. Jesus, the Lord of glory, none of the rulers of this age knew. For had they known, they would not have crucified. The Lord of glory. 1 Corinthians 2 verse 8. Jesus is the Lord of glory. He left heaven and its glories to be born as a babe in Bethlehem. Heaven was magnified by the presence of Jesus, but he gave up its luster and glory to be born in a humble stable and to be part of a poor family. When he left the side of the Father to come to earth, he was the Lord from glory. He gave it all up because of his love for fallen humanity. Jesus is the Lord of glory who came to die for the world. Jesus, thank you for giving up your heavenly home to come to earth for sinners. Thank you for giving up your glory to suffer the agonies of Calvary for me. Jesus left the glories of heaven, knowing he would return. The night before he died, Jesus prayed, And now, O Father, glorify me together with yourself, with the glory which I had with you before the world, was John 17 verse 5. Jesus was the Lord from glory, but when he returned to heaven, he had more glory than when he left. Jesus had added his glorious victory over sin, death, and the evil one. Now, Jesus is truly the Lord of glory. Jesus has more glory now than before he came to the world. Jesus, I want my life to add even more glory to you for all you've done for me. I can't fully understand your love, but I accept it. I glorify you because you alone are worthy of glory. Amen. Go deeper. Philippians 2 verses 1 to 11 Jesus receives additional glory for his accomplishments on Calvary. Tomorrow. The Father, our Father in heaven.